I had a lady at church tell me one time, how does it feel like pulling into the stadium and have 70,000 people screaming? And I said, well, the first thing you got to remember is they're not screaming for you. They're screaming for what's in that trailer behind you. At the first game, we were really concerned he might be too laid back because we thought right. people would think, there's something wrong with him, he just lays around all the time. <laughs> but just just the way his interactions with us mm -hmm. and and how he, he would act when strangers would come in, when they were, were, were littler pigs, uh, you know, he would come up to people where the other uh, piglets would, would kind of stay back. Okay. So he has, he likes people. He got, get back, get back, get back, come here, quit it. Quit, come here. He worked out really well, it's worked out. He's he's met and exceeded all our expectations we ever had. Of course, that first game, I'm just a nervous as a wreck, just wondering what's gonna happen, how's he gonna, you know, because there's certain things you can't uh, reproduce, mm -hmm. you know. So how's he gonna do, you know, this? How's he gonna do with that? And uh, he just really did great. Now get back, get back. I don't need your help, thank you. I don't need your help. That one with the orange stripe down his back, I call him Spaz, because he's just so spastic. Get that right, boy, get that right, yeah, oh, I know. Uh, we try to keep at least two boys, that way we always have the bloodline, mm -hmm. because uh, we have a line mascot where the father sires replacement. Come on, come on, come on. There you go, there you go, good boy, good boy. Tus Four was actually the first one that was born here on the farm. So he, he's been pretty special to us. He's just laid back, enjoying retirement. Each one of them though are, are, are kind of unique in their own ways. You get very attached to them. They're like family members. Of course, there's lots of lions, tigers, bears, and bulldogs, but there's only one Razorback. He's right here. And he's right here. And Arkansas has been so great to me and my family. I feel like this is just a way that uh, I can give back. Uh, we love sports, we love animals, we love the Razorbacks. And this is the way we put all three together and um, this is kind of our hobby and enjoyment in life. Would you leave him alone? <laughs> you never know when somebody might have a snack, you know? <laughs>